What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about older dungeons in the Elder Scrolls Online and how a lot of people in the community have wanted to see these kind of get an upgrade, get a facelift. And this is one of the things that was talked about in the recent studio director interview uh, that I've been making, you know, several videos about different topics uh, in the past week or so. If you have not seen this interview, if you want to watch it in its entirety, I will link it down in the description. Just remember, it starts off in French, so if you want to see the English uh, you know, response, the answers in English from the studio director himself, you may have to fast forward a few minutes past the start of the video or the start of the interview. But one of the questions were, you know, does Zoss ever have a plan in the future to upgrade the older original dungeon? So things like your Banished Cells 1 and 2, you know, your uh, easy, dungeon, un easy Dungeons, your Spindle Clutch 1 and 2, does, does the team ever plan on, you know, making those harder, uh, adding new content to them adding new mechanics and he gave a very simple uh kind of straightforward answer and it was no he said those dungeons are made for new players that's why they continue to make the new dungeons they've been putting out over the last several years with each year's content every dungeon that we get they're you know adding new mechanics to those making those more difficult but they have no plans whatsoever to ever redo any of those older dungeons they do not want to make the older dungeons more difficult they don't want to add new mechanics to the new uh, to the older dungeons. They want to keep all of that kind of stuff for the new uh, dungeons they add into the games uh, with new content year in and year out. He said those older dungeons are made for new players to learn how to do dungeons, to learn how to do the mechanics. So that way they can kind of get, uh, I guess, dip their toes into dungeons in general and learn how to play them. That way they can advance to more difficult newer dungeons. You know, after they kind of can start to understand how to DPS, how to heal, how to tank these older dungeons. So it does not look like we're going to get any improvements to those older dungeons. I know a lot of people have really been wanting this for a while. It's kind of like that with a lot of things in ESL. A lot of people have been wanting Overland content to be, you know, made more difficult. Or just things in general. And he kind of just said, you know, public dungeons, delves, and four-man dungeon content. Those early four-man dungeons are made for the new players. That's what it is. He said there's 20 million players, but there's millions of new players every year. And he says, uh, you know, those older dungeons, they're going to keep them like they are. They don't want new players coming into the game, and it'd be way too hard for them to learn how to do any of the dungeon content. He said he knows a lot of, you know, players anyway, or, you know, kind of, I guess, the way I, I took it was that Zoss feels a lot of new players are kind of shy about when it comes to doing dungeon content because they're afraid they're not going to be good enough or not know what they're doing and get kicked out or not know the mechanics. And that's kind of the purpose, he said, of those uh, you know those early dungeons you do right to begin with when you first start playing. They're kind of a, a learning tool, and they want to keep them that way. They don't want to make them more difficult because, he says, remember, there's new people come in all the time, and that's the way they learn. And all of the people that are wanting harder dungeon content, that's pretty much what all the new dungeons are for that they put into the game year in and year out. Anyway, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Do you like the way that, you know, that he kind of put this? Do you think that that's fair? Would you still like to see some of these older dungeons upgraded to where they would be more difficult? Or do you think that they need to be kind of left alone and, and let the new players, you know, learn how to do dungeon content? So later on, when they get into some of the newer, harder dungeons that have been added in over the years, they will have more of an understanding of exactly what's going on. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you had not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.